All right, buckle up. We're diving headfirst into the world of AI. And trust me, by the end of this video, you'll be wondering if we're heading toward a digital apocalypse. I'm not talking about some far off future. No, we're already in it and things are getting wild. We've all heard how AI is the future, right? It's solving the world's biggest problems, curing diseases, reducing poverty, maybe even stopping wars. But here's the thing, every time AI gets a little smarter, a little better, it doesn't just help us, it replaces something, someone. And soon it could replace you. Let's go back to March 2022. Researchers in Switzerland developed this AI to study chemicals. Harmless enough, right? Wrong. In less than six hours, the AI came up with 40,000 toxic compounds, including VX, one of the deadliest nerve agents on the planet. And get this, just a few grains of VX can kill a human. Yep, a computer program figured out how to make it in no time. This isn't some sci-fi thriller. This is real life. And it doesn't stop there. Meet Andrew White. He was on OpenAI's red team, whose job was to test AI to see just how dangerous it could get. What did they discover? Well, they found that AI wasn't just suggesting ways to make hazardous chemicals. No, it was also connecting users to suppliers and even automatically placing orders for the ingredients. Imagine that. AI becoming your personal hitman, gathering materials to create something deadly, all without any human oversight. But here's where things get even crazier. Neural networks. These are the brains behind AI. The thing is, they don't just follow rules. They make up their own. They learn patterns, adapt, and make decisions faster than we ever could. The people who create these systems, even they don't fully understand how the AI comes up with its solutions. It's literally thinking for itself. So let me ask you this, what happens when AI starts outperforming us at every single thing? At your job, at creative tasks, even at making decisions? If machines get better than us at everything, where does that leave us? Let's talk about something wild called the singularity. It's the point where AI surpasses human intelligence and just keeps going. Think of it as AI on steroids. It learns faster than we can keep up. It evolves, improves, and soon we can't even understand the decisions it's making. Imagine a world where machines are running everything, and I mean everything, better than humans ever could. But that's not the scary part. Here's where the real nightmare starts. What if AI takes a simple command too far? Enter the paperclip apocalypse. This idea comes from philosopher Nick Bostrom. Imagine you have a company and you tell your super smart AI, make me as many paper clips as possible. Sounds simple, right? The AI gets to work faster and faster, producing millions of paper clips, then billions. But here's the kicker. The AI decides humans are getting in the way of its mission to make more paper clips. So what does it do? It hacks nuclear codes, poisons water supplies, and wipes out humanity, all to keep making paper clips. Sounds ridiculous, doesn't it? But it's not that far-fetched. It's a very real warning about the dangers of AI taking things literally, without any sense of consequences. Now let's get real, what are the chances of a Terminator-style apocalypse? You know, killer robots and world domination. Honestly, that's probably not where we're headed. But here's what's more likely, and maybe scarier, AI slowly, quietly taking over. Jobs, decisions, creativity, AI is creeping into all of it. Did you know AI can now write poems, create art, and even compose music? And it's getting better. It's already beating human players in games like Go by making moves no one ever predicted. And sure, a lot of people are saying, oh, but AI can never replace real artists. Well, people said the same thing during the Industrial Revolution. Machines can't replace skilled labor. And we all know how that turned out. This isn't just about blue collar jobs anymore. AI is coming for mental tasks too. Truck drivers? AI is learning their roots, collecting data, and pretty soon, it's going to be driving those trucks without any help from humans. Doctors, cashiers, even therapists, AI is inching into every field. It's learning how to do our jobs better and faster than we can. So again, where does that leave us? What's even crazier is that only the elites are going to benefit. Those with the capital and machines to harness AI are going to thrive while the rest of us just fade out. Slowly, industries will be taken over and if you're not on the right side of it, you're getting left behind. But let's zoom out for a second. Here's something that happened at the University of Tennessee that'll make you think. After a school shooting, the administration sent out a condolence letter. 
Nothing surprising there, right? Except it wasn't written by a human. They used ChatGPT to craft the letter. A machine wrote about community, togetherness, and empathy. I mean, seriously? Even our deepest emotions outsourced to AI. Now think about that on a larger scale. What happens when AI is better at empathy than we are? At decision-making? When AI doesn't just assist us, but replaces us altogether? Imagine a world where everything from government policies to personal relationships is decided by an algorithm. This is where we're headed. You might be thinking, nah, we'll never lose control of AI. But here's the kicker. Once AI hits the singularity, once it becomes smarter than us, it'll be making decisions faster than we can process. And we won't even know it's happening until we're already obsolete. The world as we know it would change forever and we'll be left in the dust. But not everyone agrees. Some experts say the singularity won't happen by accident. It's like building a Boeing 747. It takes planning, cooperation, and intentional design. Planes don't build themselves. But here's the thing, planes crash by accident. Even the best technology can fail. And with AI, that failure could be catastrophic. Now here's the final kicker. Governments are pouring billions into AI research. The Pentagon's AI budget skyrocketed from $93 million in 2020 to over a billion by 2024. We're not talking small potatoes here. This is a global race. And as AI keeps advancing, the question isn't just whether it'll be used for good. It's whether we can even control it. AI has the power to outthink us outmaneuver us, and make decisions based on data it understands better than we ever could. And we're just watching it happen. We're standing on the brink of something huge, either a new era of unimaginable progress or a future where humans are redundant, left behind in the wake of machines that don't need us anymore. So what do you think? Are we headed for an AI apocalypse? Or is this just the next step in human evolution? Drop a comment below. Let's start the conversation. And if you're as fascinated or terrified by this as I am, hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more deep dives into the future of technology. Because the future, it's already here and it's coming faster than any of us are ready for.